On Friday, May 24th, the Pike County Cooperative Extension Office hosted their first Coffee and Canvas event. The community was invited to share a pot of coffee, get to know one another, and get in touch with their artistic side. Mountaintop News spoke with community arts agent Christy Porter for more details. We just wanted to have the community come together and paint and have some stress relief and, and do some art. Um, we, we pick coffee this time, just, you know, we have a brunch and brush sometimes and we have where we, we have them come in and have a healthy brunch and paint. And we're just trying some different things. So this time it's a, a coffee and canvas. We'll probably do this one again, maybe next month or in the next couple of months. The community really comes out for these. We've, we've had a sign up of, uh, I think we limited this one for 20 just because of supplies. And you know, once you get too many people in there, it gets a little crowded. But uh, yeah, we usually have them fill, fill up. So we had 20 people sign up today. When working traffic in Floyd County, responding to crashes involving deaths or injuries is the toughest part of our job. When you're driving on Floyd County roads, there's so much out of your control. What you do have control over is wearing a seatbelt. Floyd County, always buckle up. The exercise demonstrated for the class was designed to help relieve stress and teach simple color theory. From there, the class could then choose how they wanted to design their painting. So today we have a lesson on the color wheel and they can choose whatever colors they want for the, the painting. We have one that can go by and, and kind of like a guide to go by and we show them you know, different brush strokes and things. But with the color wheel lesson, they can pick complementary colors. They can see what colors may contrast and may not work together. So that's the first thing we'll do is we'll go through and we'll look at the color wheel and say, okay, I like these colors. This is why they look good together. And uh, they can go from there and, and pick the colors they want for the painting and have something to take home and hang on the wall at the end of the day. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.